Hey, Tony here. For today's Slipcover Saturday, I'm going to show you my MVD Rewind Collection, so stay tuned. So MVD has done a really good job of releasing titles that haven't been released on Blu-ray before. Uh, most of these have been released only on VHS and DVD, and they ended up doing a new collection called MVD Rewind with some really nice looking retro VHS styled slipcovers. So today I wanted to show you that um, show you that collection. So first up, we um, and these are numbered. So um, starting with number one, we have DOA. Never heard of this movie before, um, but this was the first selection. Really nice. Um, details to the packaging as you can tell with the stickers and then we got attack of the killer tomatoes black eagle i really do like the way that they do these stickers savannah smiles with the vhs tape coming out of the bottom the Return of Swamp Thing. Went to Coney Island on a mission from God. Be back in five. Abominable. Lionheart. Another great one. Windrider. Really like the artwork on this one. Shadow Builder. Angel Town. Bright Lights, Big City. Nemesis. And then spine number 14, we have Double Dragon. Showdown. So a lot of action movies. Nemesis 2, 3, and 4. So it's great to have all of those. Another great one, Double Impact. Boogie Boy, My Samurai, The Point, Mind Games, Mikey, Then we have this double feature. We have Blood Fight and Iron Heart. Really like the packaging on this one. Split Second. Lots of special features as you can tell. Gun Crazy. And this right here is number 25. So in the month of May, we did get two new titles. We got Drive. And we got Action USA. So these are spines 26 and 27. So I really do enjoy this line. Um, now all of these do come wrapped in this plastic but for some reason this Action USA did not come wrapped in plastic so I can actually just show you the blu-ray so you know we have this retro type packaging for the slipcover and then we just have the regular um, blu-ray so I think a majority of those that I've shown you um, 
have different artwork on the inside but I have just decided to keep mine sealed up for as long as I can just to kind of protect them but I really do like this line of slip covers anything to do with the retro VHS style I really do enjoy um, having those. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about these slip covers and what you think about these movies. I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you'd subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and on Instagram. And if you'd like to check out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.